So the next thing that happened on AEW Dynamite, we had MJF come down to the ring. He was with uh, Sean Spears. And, you know, MJF was addressing a few things, uh, talking about CM Punk and Wardlow. Now, he was talking about Wardlow first, talking about, like, uh, how he made a promise to Wardlow that he, if, uh, you know, if he wins the TNT Championship, he'll let him keep it. But he said, you know, he couldn't get the job done last week. So, yeah, that's what MJF was saying. But then he said he'll get to Ward talk about Wardlow in a second. And that's when he was talking about CM Punk. And he was talking about how he has CM Punk beat at Revolution. Uh, just like how he beat him in Chicago and everything. That's what he was saying. And then he said uh, he's down to have another match with CM Punk eventually down the road. So yeah, that's what uh, MJF said. He said uh, it could be anywhere. Uh, and he will still beat him. So yeah, that's what MJF was saying about CM Punk. But then he tor turns his attention back to Wardlow, talking about Wardlow, talking about like, uh, you told me to release you from the contract that I'm going to tell you. No. He said uh, he's going to make his life a living hell, how he si how Wardlow signed the deal with the devil and everything, and how he's going to put him on the cross. Uh, like Jesus and all that, so yeah, that's what MJF was saying, and, uh, yeah, um, you know, he was talking a lot of crap about Wardlow, talking about, like, how you gonna provide, uh, with your sick mother and all that now, and everything, uh, and couldn't have called him a pig, called him a little greedy pig and all that stuff, and then Wardlow had enough of it, he comes running down, but MJF had, like, security guards, uh, you know, blocking the ring, and then, of course, Wardlow starts beating down a few security guards. But then uh, MJF called for more, and a bunch of them start holding Wardlow back. And then MJF looks at Wardlow. He goes like, did you forget? You ain't signed with AEW. You signed underneath me. And right now, you're trespassing. So, yeah, that's what MJF said. And uh, he said, security, take him back. And, yeah, you see Wardlow uh, getting taken off and everything. So, yeah, that's what happened there. And then uh, MJF was like, now I want to end some rumors. The pinnacle is not over because next week we're going to get to the top and FTR will be in, in the tag team match next week. So yeah, that's what uh, MJF said. And then Sean Spears uh, said, yeah, the pinnacle is always on top. And then that was the end of it. So yeah, it was a pretty good promo and stuff from MJF. Uh, great one. But up next, we're going to see Adam Cole versus Jay Lethal one-on-one -on -one up next. And yeah. That match will be happening up next. And I forgot to mention, we had um, Trent Beretta and Willer Yuta uh, backstage talking. And uh, Orange Cassidy and Chuck Taylor was with them. And Trent looks at uh, Yuta and says, I never liked you, but these guys trained you and you were trying to betray them last week. And Willer was like, look, I I'm not trying to betray anybody, but I'm not here to be best friends. I'm here to be a best wrestler. So, yeah, that's what Willie Yuta said. He walked away. So, yeah, that's what happened there. It looks like best friends kind of a little bit breaking apart now. So, yep, um, I'll see you guys later until the next thing that happens on AEW Dynamite. See you guys later until then.